Will it look strict like last spring with deserted streets and shops or more relaxed like in autumn? The French government is weighing up its options for a third nationwide lockdown, which some see as inevitable. One of their chief concerns, the economy. S'agissant des confinements entre celui qui avait eu lieu en mars, celui qui a eu en novembre, il y a eu des évolutions parce que à chaque fois, on tient compte évidemment de ce que nous avons appris des différentes périodes et on adapte. Some think a third lockdown would resemble November's, with people not able to venture further than one kilometre from their home and non-essential shops closed. The country is currently under a 6 p.m. curfew, which has aided in slowing down the spread of the virus. But several ministers have said that should that not be enough, another lockdown is inevitable. France's cases have been rising steadily since the end of November. It's currently averaging more than 18,000 new infections a day, much higher than the 5,000 hoped by Macron in December. Hospital admissions are also elevated. On the 19th of January, over 25,500 people were hospitalized, of which almost 3,000 were admitted into intensive care. The government is likely concerned about the economic impact another lockdown would have. According to their own figures, it could cost over 15 billion euros per month. To keep parents at work, it's not expected that schools will close anytime soon.